Okay, we have one of the latest or most recent models of the Shark Steamer, which has lots of attachments. Now it's start stop steaming, so I've used removed all the torque screws from the casing, which were very loosely very loosely assembled. Um, I took the nozzle side of the assembly apart, um, which sits in the upper section, and there's no blockage there. Um, you can blow through the heater element, which is this, this section here. This is the output, and the input comes in on here. And then you have the pump in this bottom corner, and the reservoir. Now the reservoir has a, a pipe attachment at the top here, with a, with a little micro filter on it. So not only have you got the coarse filter, you can see there's a vinegar mixed in there, there's a coarse filter pickup within the tank, there's actually a little uh, filter on the top, which I'll show you now. And I've just used some Viacil on that, and literally I couldn't blow through that in either direction, but after a little bit of uh, manipulation with my finger, it's better now. So if I just, just wet that now, wash that off, I'm just going to going to blow through that. You can see I can now blow through that. I mean obviously the, the fluid direction is the other way, it comes out of the tank, but I couldn't even I couldn't do that before. So I think when I reassemble this, this will have been the cause, this this micro filter at the top of the tank. So if you have to repair this yourselves guys don't strip all the nozzle assembly down, go straight to the top of the tank which just lit, pulls out just pulls out of this assembly because it's got a clear side that you can see through that hole just sits like that, pull it out take it off the top of there and clean that filter and hopefully if you had a, this, this steam is about 15 months old so it was out of warranty so I thought I'd have a go at fixing it and we've only used it three times but I think that's the key part that gets blocked up with lime scale or any debris, fine debris. I hope this helps somebody.